Hello everyone, my name is Andra and I'm a business student at the University of Illinois at Champaign-Urbana. I'm very excited to present a new and revolutionary website that can help you with your homework. This website is called Wolfram Alpha and you can find it at wolframalpha.com. I've used this website many times for my homework in areas such as linear algebra, calculus, finance, and statistics. But as you can see here in the example topics, there's many more areas that Wolfram Alpha covers. Since a lot of the University of Illinois students are taking linear algebra, I would like to show you a few examples that can help you with your inputs into Wolfram Alpha and to get the results that you need. Let's start with something simple. An equation with two unknowns. Wolfram Alpha is going to show us the plot, the line, the x and y intercepts, and the slope. Let's do something a little more complicated, such as a system of inequalities, for example. And here's an example of that, how you have to input the information into Wolfram Alpha. Wolfram Alpha is going to show you the inequality plot, it's going to give you values, x and y, and integer solutions. Now if we're trying to do something a little more difficult, such as a row reduction for a 4x4 four four matrix, usually by hand it takes about 9 steps to do it and it's rather complicated. Wolfram Alpha can do it at the touch of a button. And here's the results. Very fast. Alright, let's try another example. If we're trying to calculate the determinant of a matrix, a 3x3 three three matrix can be pretty tricky to do by hand. It's much easier if it's just a 2x2. Two two. The Wolfram Alpha can do it really quickly, and this is the result. Also, if we're trying to solve a system with three unknowns, Wolfram Alpha can come in handy, because it's a lot of work. Wolfram Alpha can do it really fast, and these are the results that we're getting. And it also shows us... Here, it's much better. Okay, let's try something else. If we're trying to raise a matrix, a 3 by 3 matrix, to a certain power, here's an example of that. Wolfram Alpha does it. Here's the result. There's also, I would like to show you some examples from finance that I used in my homework. And I gave it the present value number of years and the interest, and I was looking for the future value, and it actually gives you the annual equivalent rate, which is always a little more than the original one. Shows you a few graphs also. I have another example from finance, especially for people that are trying to buy a house, this will come in handy. If you have a mortgage, we have the loan, the down payment, the number of years, and the interest, and Wolfram Alpha will show us how much we're going to pay monthly. It's going to tell us how much we're paying in the interest and our total payments, and it's also going to tell us how the monthly payment will change according to how many payments we have for the loan. We can also do an example from statistics. We're just giving some random numbers. And, but Wolfram Alpha knows what to do with them. He understands that we're trying to look for something and we're just going to give us a few results to see what we're looking for. And it gives us the mean, medium, standard deviation, the plot, total, the vector, and normalized vector. It gives you a lot of information about just a few random numbers that you plugged in. Very nice. So now that you've seen some of the examples and how to input data into Wolfram Alpha, I would encourage you to go to this website, the Homework Day, which is a live interactive web event that will take place on October 21st, 2009. Please feel free to send any homework questions you might have or videos you made using Wolfram Alpha and how Wolfram Alpha helped you find these answers. Help us showcase your ideas to the world. Thank you, everyone.